A gamer here and I just played episode 3 yesterday and I cried like a little girl. It was the most heartbreaking episode I've ever played on this Walking Dead. So what I decided to do is since episode 2 was amazing, episode 3 brought me to tears, I suspect episode 4 is going to be pretty damn amazing. And I'm going to record it. Let's go. For, for those of you who haven't gotten this far, I suggest not watching this because I'm going to be very spoilery. I'm actually going to start right now. Spoiler alert. Uh, Clementine almost becomes a zombie. Duck gets shot in the head by me. Kaja, or as I like to call her, Ketchup, committed suicide. And I cried. Why did Duck have to die? <sighs> Duck died. I shot him. And Lily, being a bitch, she ran away. She left the group. I tried to give her a second chance, she knocked me, she threw me out of the RV, and she ran away like a little girl. So now, um, we're at um, Atlanta, trying to find Clementine's parents. And as soon as, as soon as it finishes loading... Previously oh. on The Walking Dead. Previously on The Walking Dead. Shut up, Carly! Ugh, I've heard enough out of you! Oh, and Carly gets shot now, in the face. what the fuck's the problem? Oh my god! Just get in. Figure out what to do with you. I was trying to protect all of us. Holy shit! She's stealing the RV. Yeah, I gave I her don't a second much chance, about you and folks, she ruined it. But I can tell you, as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow, y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Why? Why didn't Doug have to? We need to help find a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Okay. But we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. Okay, we'll look for them. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! We... Ah! That's gotta Shit. hurt. Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need... I don't know, but I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. And there's somebody trying to steal Ke Clementine. I haven't killed many people in this game, except Duck, which I feel very sorry for, but if I find that guy, he's getting a bullet to the face. Or a shotgun, or an axe, or a shovel, or my fist. He's gonna be missing some teeth after I'm done with him. Either that, or I'll just probably leave him to the walkers. Whichever comes first. Eh... The one thing this game does good is emotion. I haven't cried this much since uh, Click, that one movie. Yeah. <sighs> we'll be fine. I'll be fine. I just blow my nose after this. We'll be fine. We'll be perfectly fine. Telltale Games presents. In association with Skybound, The Walking Dead. They really should have actually had someone say that. That would have been pretty cool. Then again, silence is golden. Alright. So we're in Atlanta. We jack the train. Have a hobo with us. And we got problems, I'm guessing. This place is abandoned. Episode 4. Around every corner. They ignore that little beat. Can't I just hold it? Just for a little while, we're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. No. Maybe I can... Not now. I need you to focus. Keep your attention on the street. Okay. Sorry. How's Omid? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. 
He needs to rest. <laughs> uh, we need to keep moving, actually. It's not safe to stop out here in the open. We need to keep moving. He can rest after we find a boat and get out on the water. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're going to have to carry him. It's only a broken Believe leg. Me. What? No, that's not an option. We can't- Lady, I've known you for all of 12 hours. You don't get to say we unless you mean just you and him. You know, since this all started, I've seen the best come out of a lot of people and the worst come out of a lot of others. Guess we know which side you came down on. There you go again. We. There is no we. I'll help there's carry us, him. and there's you and your boyfriend slowing us down. You I'll... need some help with him? Yeah, that'd be great. I'll carry Thanks. him. Oh, meet here. Give me your arm. No problem. Then again, Kenny did lose his what family. What the hell? Well, that's not good. Someone's in the church. Either that or it's... Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. Hmm. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Good question. <gasps> Somebody's Someone's there. up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! Hey. If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. I thought so too. Who is this? Is that you up in the bell tower? I think we should go. What was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Good idea. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? Oh no. It tolls for thee. That would be a good idea. Where do they come from? These guys fuck out of thin air. Go. Run! Everybody, run! Oh, except for mid, you can you can limp. Headshot. Fuck the time. Fuck. Getting out of here. What is this? Whack a zombie now? Kitty! Don't worry, I got you, buddy. Headshot. A little too close, don't you think? Watch where you're running, man. No, Ben, help her! Do something, Ben. Ben, if you did your, you son of a gun! God I will it. shoot you myself. I don't know how much ammo those guns got, but making it worth it. Making it worth it. Come on! God damn it! I'm a terrible shot. No! no! Thank you, Josh. Get the hell out of here. I'll say it's up with you. Chuck's got more balls than that. Move your asses! River Street's right up ahead! That's not all. I'll give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? He's, uh... Come on, Chuck! He's in trouble. We gotta help him. Oh yeah, we do. He got more balls than Ben. Oh, ben, Ben, go, go help him. What do we do? <laughs> There's no time. We gotta go now. I'll be fine. Just go. Oh, Everyone's just dying. These episodes. I'll get the door. Mono mid can't seriously be tripping over everything. You okay? Ah, uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Ow. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We've gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Good plan. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll Break work it. faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. I'll find a you way. You know in. they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. Let's see. Alright, well, 
I'm gonna talk. Let's. Well, since there's no timer, let's let's have ourselves a little old merry conversation. Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? We'll be fine. I don't think they saw us. No, they didn't see us. We were too fast for them. I can still hear them out there. It sounds like they're getting closer. It's, it's just your away imagination. From the gate, I'll feel safer when we're inside the house. Good plan, come in time. All right, I'll make How's he looking? I'm all right. You're not all right. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected, it could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. <laughs> Probably looks worse than it is. Try not to worry. It always looks worse than it really is. Except when it's a bite. Yeah, hey. well, it's not a bite. We're gonna get you fixed up. Just get us inside the house, will you? I'm on right. it. Lee? Yeah? Thanks. No problem. No problem. Alright, let's see. We need to break it in. Do something. Let's see. Ben, you suck. I'm gonna talk to you. I'm gonna give you some more. Ben. About Clementine. Yeah. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. I hear you. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. Uh, I think that's good. I'm gonna go check things out. All right. You gotta be a way in. Kenny, what do you know? Oh, the door coming. How's it coming? Found a way in yet? Door's locked up tight. Too heavy to force it without making a whole lot of noise. Maybe there's a better way in. Well, if there is, I ain't seeing it. I'm gonna check behind the mouse. Oh, I think you. Mm, I think we're good. I think I'll go have a look around. All right, Kenny, you do. You do what you'd be doing. I'm gonna see if I can do anything else. Hmm, maybe I can fly over these. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. Oh, damn it. See, open. No way we're gonna force that open. Not without making a lot of noise, at least. Hmm. Gotta be something here. Tree, tree. No, no tree. Hello. Pet door. Hmm. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. Clementine can probably fit. I tried right. it already. That's locked too. Wait, really? Who yeah. the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I That's have. My neighborhood went just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Well, Damn, shit. High tech, Every day's a school day. Well, All right, so where's the dog? Probably dead somewhere. Found it. Found doesn't work. Graveyard. Doghouse. I'm pretty sure he's mountained in the dirt. Looks so like something was buried here. I need a shovel. Wait a second, Chuck has a god damn it. Yeah, that would have been too easy. Chuck has a shovel. God damn it. Looks like something was buried here. Uh please tell me Chuck's alive somewhere with a shovel. Can I go outside and find Chuck? No, I cannot. What's the other plan? Just don't have a plan. Let's see. Maybe I can just bust it open? Damn, that's a Dude, tough doggy I'm door. Not gonna break that thing open. All you're gonna do is make a lot of noise we don't need. Well then, what the hell am I supposed to do? Let's see. Oh, well then, there's a shovel right here. Uh, the sorry, Chuck, you've never been replaced. Not useful. And I'm about to go dig up a, do a dead dog. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be. You know what I mean? Oh. Yeah, I hear you. That's a good statement right there. Hey, what's the buried down there? there? Hopefully the dog with the collar. And please tell me it is dead. Stay away. Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Krista and Omi, okay? But I want to... Just do what I say, okay? Aw, Clementine feels hurt, but I didn't mean to. I was trying to protect her. Alright. 
Oh god, the smell. Okay. Does it have a collar? I am Can't get it off. Okay, Ew. that is not cool. Ew. Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? I think she's pregnant. Alright, I got the dog collar Clementine. Come here, you're gonna be, um... Gonna do a little detective work. Like Duck. Like Duck used to do. Poor Ducky. It goes nothing. Maybe it still works. Hell yeah, it does. Yes! God damn! Alright, Clementine. You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. That doesn't sound good. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Come on, Clement. Oh my god. Please, let's no go. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. Good job, Clementine. You're the smartest person out of here. Clem, what do you see in there? Good job, Clementine. Smartest person out of all of us. Good job, Clem. Good job, Clem. Yeah, way to go. I did good, right? Yes, you did. You did good. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Good idea. Let's go inside. Hopefully no one's alive. We're dead. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. Chuck. Damn it. Why do we leave? Yippee! Chuck. Ignore that li you Oh my god. Shut up. Ignore that little yippee. That was uh, unintentional. This house looks fancy. And of course, there has to be a family. Uh, sorry. Sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. Oh, there's a doggy there. Cute. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? It that work. it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? Well, I did only find out yesterday. I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? Good question. How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. Whoever that was on the radio, I think they were trying to help us. They did warn us, didn't they? Maybe you're right. But whoever it was, they're watching us. Following us. And they don't want us to know who they are. I can't think of any explanation for that that would make me feel better. Can you? These are all very good valid points. I have nothing to say. Uh... I'll rest I up. think we could all use a little time to rest up and gather our thoughts, Kenny. At least until those walkers outside wander off and old meat's feeling better. That and we should find Chuck. He best feel better quick. I ain't gonna wait around here too long. Uh, poor Chuck. Place seems secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> Good statement. Right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. Can I help? What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen and Omid need anything, okay? <laughs> okay. Alright, time to check up the house is secure. Chalk is gone. 
there's a nice old cabinet here I'm gonna check out the house there's dog food anyway that's it for this part I'm gonna check out the house see what's in here and I'll check back Nate next time thank you kindly